Right, I'm in Needale. Park the car. In for the ladies. Starting to make my way up now, and the place is overrun with walkers. By the bus load. So, uh, I have plenty of people to follow. <laughs> And I guess I'm going up there and up around and down. So, but it's so uh, <coughs> foggy, overcast, but it's meant to be dry. But it's actually relatively warm. So I'm actually carrying probably far too much stuff that I don't need. But I like to be prepared. Right, just coming off the road now. I'm getting onto the track. Following a little group there. Hey, me. Wow, <clears throat> it's so warm. I had to stop and take some layers off. I'm still hot. Oh, blinking thermal shirt. Should have just worn an ordinary one. But uh, might be cold when I get to the top. In the meantime, it's going to be very uncomfortably warm. And that's where I'm going. Path so far, and uh, it's quite, quite a bit warm. I need to do a little strip tease and change out the top. <laughs> so, I tried to cross the river here, and I slipped over. A little bit of water. Yeah. and bloody quiet. That many bloody walking groups up here. Kids doing the Duke of Edinburgh. Oh, nah, 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 nah. They walk past you then they stop and rest and so you've got to go up and walk past them and then they start walking again. Pain in the freaking ass. Anyway, I'll let them get ahead. I'm pretty sure it's this way I've got to go actually. Not that way. Quiet moment. And it seems to have such a fucking busy mountain. God. Well, I went slightly off track, just trying to find the path again. That's what happens. There's so many bloody people here up here. No, you've been up following them and uh, then realise they're taking you to the wrong place. God, I won't go up here on a set day again. Anyway, I should be nearly on the path to go to the downfall. A bit boggy. Hillside. Just one massive friggin' bog. Well, I just got stuck in that bog. 
my shoe. I had to pull my foot out of my shoe to get out of the bog. Then I had to go and dig my uh, shoe out down there. And you can see the hole. Oh, it's back in stuck river. Oh, I'm wet and covered in mud. Dear me, I thought I was going to leave my boot behind at one stage. Well, that would have been fucking great. <laughs> anyway, after getting stuck in bog and then coming across a gorge that I couldn't get across because of the bog. I came across a group of uh, people from Southampton, network people. So then I um, decided to walk with them back to um, Edale. Uh, a bit disappointed I couldn't get to the downfall, but um, it was just an absolute nightmare. So we walked back to about here anyway. I've stopped to have a cup of tea because uh, I was flagging a bit. But to where, where I think we're after the most up up there is just uh, horrendous. I mean, my feet are squelching, and uh, I'm just um, pleased that uh, <laughs> my boot wasn't too tight on my foot. Cause I managed to pull it out of my boot to get out of the bog. Then I could turn around and dig my boot out. But it's just nice and pleasant up here. I certainly won't be attempting to go in across that way for a long, long time. I might come down and go up the other side, up Jacob's Ladder to the downfall, and then just find another path back down, and not come across the top, because it's just there's no path markings. Uh, it's really, really bad. And so anyway, it's now, whew, I've been going for five and a quarter hours. Having a cup, finishing up my tea and some of my little uh, muffiny things, which are rather nice. Regrouping and then I shall be heading down. Okay, this is pretty steep going down. It looks like it's snow, but it's not. It's just uh, the grass is but you see civilization that's a welcome sight after those bogs I hope you can hear me I'm saying there's civilization over there in case you didn't hear me I'm just going to get down the steep hill that's bloody steep oh, I've still got a bit more to go yet before I get down on the path Oh, I'll be glad to get back to the car today. I've had enough of this kinder scout, I'll tell you that. I keep thinking, oh, it's not far now. And I've still got that steep bit to go down. Oh, I've just come down that steep hill there, and now I'm on the Pennine Way. Heading back to, I think it's called Gilbrook, which is near Edale. So I haven't got too far to go. And it shouldn't be too bad walking compared to what I've been putting up with all day. Ugh. Right, ever since I got soaked it way inside once, I've kept a few extra bits and pieces in the car that I have. Dry socks and some lounger pants to go and get changed into. Oh, well worth it. So, yeah, I'll give you my summary of the old um, walk once I've gone and got changed. Right, it's uh, what 5:54. Uh, 
changed or changed my trousers and my socks. My boots are going to take some cleaning, I can tell you that. And uh, that was hard work. I was not expecting the bog that bad. You know. Um, so. Because I was really, really stuck and that bog was down to my knees. Tell you what, if I couldn't have slipped my shoot my foot out of my boot, I would have had to have been sitting there until someone came along. Anyway, so uh, I gave up trying to get to Kinder Down Fall, um, and I like hooked up with that group from Network and walked with them back most of the way, and then uh, stopped and had me break, and then I came down that bloody really really steep hill, thought it'd never end. So it was quite a challenging day, quite a, well, considering I slipped, I fell over in the stream, <laughs> got stuck in bog, it was a bit of a disastrous day, but I'm still here to tell the tale, so there you go, I don't think I'll be coming to Kinder Scout too soon in the near future, I might come back and try Jacob's Ladder, because that takes you up to the, the the falls and then find a path back down but I won't go across the top again like that that's it was a joke you couldn't see a path I mean I had my OS out and where the path was there was nothing you know, it was a big big um, you know gorgeous you had to get go across and the thing is this it's it, like I said because it's bog. It's um it's not just mud. You can you know you can manage a bit of water and a bit of mud. When you step in something and you sink sink down to your knee, and you can't pull your leg back up. It's not very pleasant. Anyway, I've got another hour and a half drive to get home now. <laughs>